heard a story recently about this missionary to Africa named Ira, Ira Gillett. And he had come back home on furlough and he was reporting just all that God had done and everything like that. And he said one of the things that he noticed, which blew him away, he was talking about just how much, you know, Christians, their, their love for, for people can make a huge difference even on the mission field. And, and, he, get, and he was talking about like um, the, the, the group that he was with, they, they had this missionary compound where they provided medical care. And a lot of the villagers, what would happen is that a lot of the villagers would walk miles to come and receive medical care from the missionaries there. And he was blown away because there was hospitals that were closer to some of these villagers. The government provided all, you know, medical supplies, everything. But they would walk miles. And so one day he asked one of the villagers, he's like, why, why don't you just go to the, to the hospital that's closest to you instead of walking so many miles? And one of the villagers looked at him and he said, the medicines may be the same, but the hands are different. And what he was saying is that, is that he, could, he experienced something different from the Christians that were there. He experienced the, the loving hands of Jesus. And friends, that's what we're called to be, is to be the hands and feet of Jesus. Scripture, Jesus said that, that the world would know that we are truly disciples by our love. And so friends, if we're going to impact others, we have to first start with love. And maybe you have a hard time loving others. Maybe you've been jaded. Maybe your heart has been calloused over. Maybe you've been hurt by others. And man, today, all of us, we need to ask God to, to give us a heart that loves people like he loves people. To give us eyes to see like he sees people. You can have all the correct theology in the world. You can know all these scriptures. But if you don't have love, what good is it? We're called to love people. 